Hello there and good morning. Welcome to Porto, Portugal. Today, I'm on a bit of an adventure, a little bit of a tourist adventure, but more so a culinary adventure. Because, as some of you know, there is a very famous dish in this part of the country, in this, just this country in general, something called a Francesinha. Literally, it translates to little Frenchie, or French person in the diminutive, or something French in the diminutive. Not that it matters. But, today also, it's a little bit more special than just recording. I'm gonna have some guests along with me. As some of you may have already realized, Not Your Average Globetrotter recently has been sponsored by Border.io. They help people to get their NIFs, their Portuguese tax code, as well as bank accounts and so on here in Portugal. We started talking about, wait, what if we actually met up and did something in person together? And I said, well, I actually have an idea regarding that that could work and could be a little bit fun. So today what we are going to do is actually compare and contrast the Francesinha in Porto versus the Francesinha in Braga, my city. Because in Braga, there are a lot of people who say, oh, this is the best one, the one in Porto. So doesn't even compare. You can't even talk about it. The sauce is completely different. So I wanted to put this to the test a little bit, just personally, because I haven't had that many Francesinhas here in Porto. Yes, I have had, but many fewer than in Braga. So for some scientific testing, I thought it'd be worthwhile. And so right now I'm just heading to the meeting point. The transport to get into the city was a little bit longer than I was hoping for, but Still here, on time, ready to roll. If you ever come to Portugal during Christmas time, you absolutely have to try this cake, or at least something similar to it. All right, so just met up with these guys. You want to quickly introduce yourselves, who you are? I'm Kathleen. I'm Neha. And I'm Richard. And so these guys are from Border. Well, these two are from Border, and she's also kind of from Border, I guess. Yeah, our summer intern. <laughs> Very exciting. And so we decided we're going to go to a place here that's kind of on Google, one of the more popular locations, at least according to Google, and it matches up with a place over in Braga. So that's what I was thinking could be worthwhile checking out. It's just down this way over here, so let's head off. <laughs> so, in the end, the most popular place was closed. It's just right behind me over there, so we can't go in there. But there's another place that seems to be just a peg down, but hopefully it's open. The door seems to be. Let's see. I think we're good. Yeah. All right. Okay. Uh, yes. Okay. 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 <laughs> yeah, of course you want to be right on camera. Let's put this right, right here. <laughs> Let's see what's going on here. Vegetarian? No, not quite. So the price is also not horrible. Although actually the half price is kind of shocking. <laughs> so, all right. Well, we've got three Francesi aficionados here, but we do have one person at the table who's never had one before. So, do you feel like you're prepared for this experience, this this monstrosity that's about to be on your plate in front of you? <laughs> Honestly, no. But I didn't eat today, so... So you're well prepared. I didn't prepare. Mentally, maybe not. Physically, yes. <laughs> well, let's, let's see how it goes and, um, yeah. Hopefully it comes soon. Yeah. French fries to share. So, take care. Okay. So, plate here is very, very hot. <laughs> Muito obrigado. Uh, Gotta show her face. <laughs> <laughs> you ready for this? Uh, this is Nina to share. Ah, yeah, let's put it in the middle. Ah, uh, okay. Then you'll cut it here. Yeah. Do the same for you. Take care. <laughs> oh, and I think, enjoy. Thank you. Thank you. Well, these actually look pretty, pretty amazing. Fries on the side. Bon appetit. Or, uh, how do you say Portuguese? 
Bom, vou repetir. Não. Uh, bom, bom proveito. Bom proveito. Enjoy. <laughs> Curious to hear your first yeah. thoughts of the, the Francesinha experience. Yeah. Okay. First of all, how do you eat that with your hands? Obviously, you don't. You don't. No. <laughs> you don't. You don't. It's a fork and knife type right. deal. Okay. It's a fork and knife sandwich. Okay. <laughs> Careful, don't touch that one. Yeah. I already burnt myself on one. Okay. This is nice because then you can show the inside. Yeah, the, okay, let's the cross section there. action though. <laughs> it really is something else. Let's put some sauce on it. Oh my god. I'm going to show some my mom. <laughs> so you're like, my daughter, what are you eating? <laughs> yeah, she's like... What has Portugal done to my good little girl? <laughs> she's now eating like a monster. My dad was so healthy before. <laughs> I know, just like so healthy. <laughs> Leaving America was supposed to be the healthy choice. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah what about that Mediterranean diet? <laughs> <laughs> this is crazy. I know it's concerned like this What we can do is maybe ask them for extra sauce. Yeah. Oh, yeah. sauce. <laughs> no, you don't really want sauce. Like, it's, it's part fries. of the thing. It's for, it's for the fries and everything, yeah. Because normally, like, I'll put the fries in here. There's a whole debate if you should put the fries in or not, oh, or really? when to put the fries in. Oh, <laughs> our, our Brazilian friend is just like, just dumping it. <laughs> What's the debate? If you should do it sooner or later. Do like, you do it at the, the beginning or do you do it at the happen? end? Like, they get soggy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Cheers. Okay. It's a solid French cuisine. Yeah. Honestly, it tastes good. Yeah, you like it? Yeah. I feel like it looks crazy, but it's actually delicious. It actually tastes nice. Like a. I don't know, it tastes like a grilled cheese cake. Yeah. Like some like some meats in it. It's basically it's, it's bread, yeah. and then cold cuts, steak, bread, cheese. Sauce and, an and then an egg. egg, and then each place does it a little differently. All the sauces are different. Like, oh, okay. if you have the sauce here, it's going to taste different at the place down the street, what and it's going to be different than also in Braga. What sauce? Beer, beer sauce. Oh. So far, how's it going? Good coffee. Yeah. Good. I think it's great. Mm -hmm. I'm. I'm very happy. I can say I'm also the pleasantly sauce surprised. It's like a little bit spicy. Yeah, a little bit of spice goes a long way. Yeah. I like it when you don't have to ask for like the extra sauce on the side. Like, hey, can you bring the spicy sauce or mm -hmm. add that in there? Okay. So it looks like the place that we're trying to go to actually has two locations. One right here and then one down there, but we missed it. But we ended up here, it was great. So I guess I'll have to come back. Yeah. <laughs> Part two coming soon. <laughs> so, thoughts after the first Francesinha? That was good. Yeah, would you get it again? I mean If I you weren't gonna get it later on this evening. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I would choose it as a first option. Okay. It's like, oh, I need lunch. Let me go get that. Or well, maybe this personal preference. It was good though. It, yeah. It You'd have fun. to be in the mood for it. Sounds yeah. Like. I'd have to be having not eaten any meals in that whole day <laughs> before I could eat even half. <laughs> yeah, because you only had half in the end. Well, that's the first part. Anyway, it's off back to Braga, and then later on part two of this same part, so no need to go anywhere. <laughs> well, just before we get to the next half of the episode, I wanted to give just a quick little insert here as to what's going on. So in this first part, you've seen that we were in Porto. You saw that we got there, we tried out the sandwich, and immediately upon the first bite, I already had my mind made up which was better. There are some differences between Braga and Porto as far as the Francesinhas go. Braga is known for a little bit more of a thicker sauce and Porto a bit thinner, a lot more runny. The one place that we actually went to wasn't all that runny, but regardless, it was definitely delicious. It was really something that I know I enjoy. But even though in Portugal, Porto is really the city that's known to be where it's from, it's actually got its roots from France, Croque Monsieur. 
the information I found was mixed, whether it was a Portuguese chef who was in France or Belgium and then made his way back here, or if it was a French chef that came from there to here. The, the original place seems to still exist today, but it's not necessarily the most well-known place. But of course, later on, we're gonna go and try the Braga style version of the Francesinha and hoo 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 hoo. I absolutely love it. I can't wait till I get my next one. This was actually recorded a few weeks ago when they were all up here. But Richard and Kathleen are from a company called Border.io. Like I mentioned, Border has recently sponsored some episodes of Not Your Average Globetrotter. There'll be a link on the screen, uh, border.io slash NYAG. If you're interested in more information and you're thinking about moving to Portugal, they help people get the, the NIF, the tax code, and to be able to get a bank account here, they're really focused on customer support, customer satisfaction, and really being reliable here. So that's one thing. If you are thinking about moving to Portugal, definitely worth getting in contact with them. I can just say from a personal perspective, they are now people who I definitely consider friends. They are so sweet, so friendly, so kind. We had a wonderful day together. We spent a very, very full day together and had a lot of laughs along the way. And of course, what better type of way of bonding with others over a meal? And then also something else that we did while we were here in Braga was that we actually sat here did a sit down session, talked about them coming to Portugal, their company, what they do, and that's going to be a future episode. So be sure that you're subscribed for that because it's actually interesting. It gives you not only an insight about what they do, but also uh, another perspective on coming to Portugal. So anyway, I think it's about time that we skip ahead to Braga. So let it roll. Muito obrigado, senhor. Obrigado. 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 Boa noite. <laughs> Just, we'll see, but it seems like like it's moving. It's moving. It's really yeah, moving. so I'm not too worried. Going. But it's amazing, even like it's packed inside, it's packed outside. This is the place to be. Very exciting. You gotta ask Neha how how she's feeling though. Yeah. <laughs> what what are your thoughts? What's going through your mind? I will say I feel hungry now. Yeah. Like I am ready to eat. So. It's been. Nine, Nine hours. Eight. <laughs> eight hours. Many yeah. hours. Eight hours. It yeah. took that long to get over that last meal. That was a. That was a very serious. And meal. I only ate half. Yeah. So. Right. So you're ready. I'm ready. I do feel ready mentally and physically again. <laughs> so, emotionally. Emotionally, I am prepared. I did prepare myself before I knew what I was going to be doing. So I'm ready to uh, give you guys my verdict. What's better? We're good. You heard it here. She's ready. <laughs> we got a table. Fifteen minutes later. Sixteen minutes later. We made it. <laughs> oh, didn't view you or something? Oh, uh, I think that's going to be the way to go. Yeah. Oh. I mean, also the prices here, comparing them to Porto, it's a little bit less. Because the, the half one there was 10 something, and the whole one was 12 something. Yeah, I think I'm definitely going for a quok. What's the beer you're talking about? Yeah, this one. Nice. Okay, okay. It's a it's high alcohol volume. God. But if you want like a lighter here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh garden? Which one? Do they have it here? No, that's quite a beer. Yeah. <laughs> Should I pour the whole thing in there? Yeah. Is that like yeah. how people do that? 
No, it's okay. It's, she got it. <laughs> bravo, bravo. <laughs> nice, nice save. <laughs> well, cheers to round two. Cheers, cheers. Yes. 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 And you're right, it does look bigger. I think it is, I think it is bigger. <laughs> it's, even the fries portion, even, I mean, it's on one plate, but still. Oh, they brought you your sauce? Yeah. 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 Oh, since you're cutting it in half again, we're gonna have to get the, the cross section. Okay, yeah. here we go. Here we go. I'm gonna cut you a bigger piece. <laughs> the egg almost looks like more of a real egg somehow than the last one. Yes. Oh, wow. wow, beautiful. Look that was at that. Nice. Beautiful. Higher quality meat as well. Yeah. Wow. Something else. Okay. Let's go. Here we go. So, you had your first bites. I did. And what are the results? I have to say, this is a million times better. You heard it here. <laughs> <laughs> That's, those are fighting words. A million's a lot. <laughs> That's serious. I'm serious. I'm serious about food, so. Yeah, the, the meat here is, I mean, it is a better cut of meat. Yeah. We had so, the option to get yeah, a better cut. Yeah, so we, we got the better cut. But it's better flavor, too. Yeah, the sauce. The sauce is much sauce. better. And the fries. The fries are better. The fries are also better there. Beer. I mean, there's not like American, like, McDonald's fries, but they're good. They're really good. And then here, as you guys know, I'm not much of a drinker, but. The quack matches perfectly with the Francesinha. Rock and wine. Oh, yeah. And that was the thing, like, I was I was telling you guys, like, I didn't want to say anything, because, like, yeah, my yeah. opinion was already made up earlier. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. mean, we felt the same way, too, because, like, we had only ever had Francesinhas in Porto, and we could not understand the hype. We were just like, okay. Yeah. It's okay. And then when we came here, we were like, oh, this is what a Francesinha is. The sauce, the sauce is just like, yeah, so yeah. much better. But yeah, like, it's the, it's just the quality. Like the overall package. Much better. Yeah, the whole package actually. Yeah, it like, just seems higher quality. Also, the the bread. That's the place where we were. Oh, hey! Okay. <laughs> what? What did you say? What did you say? <laughs> oh my god! Say it, say it again. <laughs> I said I'd actually eat this sometime. The other one, I was like, I would never order this. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I would never order the other one. Or like, I would never yeah. go eat that. But like, I would put my money here, maybe. Like. Whoa! Whoa. Moon, that is serious. Yeah. That is very serious. Yeah, Raga did a good job. You heard it here, folks. I will say. Braga. Braga wins. Braga wins. Braga wins. Braga wins. Braga wins. <laughs> Braga wins. Viva Braga. Forza Braga. Braga. Mm -hmm. To have a French scene yet to bear the have. You've come all the way here. Yeah. 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 We've done it. Really? Last time we were here, well, last time we came to Porto, we got our friends who live in Gaia. To pick us up and drive <laughs> they to Braga, to they just for the, this restaurant, and then we went back. Seriously, we had no, we had nothing it. else it. here. <laughs> we didn't even go to Bomish Resort, like nothing. I was just about that. No wonder you don't know the center all that well. <laughs> <laughs> you just come to Belgium. No, never a priority. <laughs> I'm actually pleasantly like, shocked. No, I didn't think it was gonna be that good. Mm -hmm. I was like, I don't really understand like how. Right. How could like, it be that good? Yeah. You're like, how could it? Or like, how could it be like better? Right. What is better? So. <laughs> Definitely. If you're confused, <laughs> you don't need to be confused anymore. <laughs> I'm the biggest critic, anyways, <laughs> of everything. So, you know, my opinion is true. Yeah, I mean, it's it's no comparison between the two. So you already thought that in your mind prior. Yeah, when we were there, I, I bit into. I was like. It's good, but <laughs> right, right, right. it's not. It's not Braga good. <laughs> it's pretty. They're just like on another level. Yeah. Well, especially. I mean, again, like we did opt for the higher quality meat here, yeah. so that's part of like what we kind of our experience is definitely 
colored by that. Mm. But also like, but they also didn't have an option for half your product. True, yeah. very yeah. true. And the yeah, they only had two options. It was sauce, either half or full. <laughs> they have a spicy sauce, the mm. fries are better. Also the way they cooked the meat was the same. Like the other place, I feel like the meat was like well done as well. The meat um, was a little funky but there for I me. I don't yeah. like it. I was like, Dry. this make me like sad. Like, <laughs> But this, like the meat actually tastes good. And I'm not a big steak girl. Yeah, this is, I mean, this is like super steak. serious. <laughs> Because you got steak, and then chorizo, ham, <laughs> more ham, and bread, bread, cheese, bread, sauce. I don't know what the sauce. second meat was in the other one, but it wasn't... The chorizo was a little funky It was chorizo one. because I... There was yeah, chorizo it was like and meat. ham. Yeah, yeah, it was. Yeah. It tasted like a, like almost like a Lunchables kind yeah, of yeah, yeah, yeah. ham. Mm -hmm. Not the Lunchables. <laughs> Quite a long day. It is, what is it, like 11.45 at night. It's a long day. We've been eating franchisees what feels like non-stop. <laughs> I don't think <laughs> two franchisees in 12 hours. Bad enough like in like two days. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's right. But worth it? Maybe. I think so. <laughs> it was quite the experience. All right. <laughs> She's still standing. I'm still alive. Survived. So that's the most I important part. Somehow I didn't think that would. <laughs> Well, thank you so much for coming up to Braga for the visit, for the trip, and to Portos. Thanks for so great to meet in person. Yeah. This is awesome. Of course. I can't wait till the next, well, maybe sans Frenchies. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Maybe, let's hey, just have, have, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. have her run up Bon Jesus, go back and forth, <laughs> work it up. It could be, it could be. <laughs> wait, that's All right, well, stay safe and healthy out there. See y'all next time. Bye-bye. <laughs> Later. <laughs>